There's a full moon over Tulsa I hope that it's shining on you The nights are getting cold In Cherokee County There's a blue northern passing through I remember green eyes And a rancher's daughter But remember is all that I do Losing you left A pretty good cowboy With nothing to hold on to Sundown came and I drove to town And drank a drink or two You're the reason God made Oklahoma You're the reason God made Oklahoma you're missing All right, here's the uh, the first day hunt. Uh, Tennessee Trio got here at the time to hunt about four hours, and we didn't make any pictures because it's just about dark. And uh, so uh, JJ had to find the day corn wise yesterday with the 1875 seeded. John had the uh, he had the find of the day from our hunt yesterday afternoon for our hunt, and got the center of a breastplate and a couple of eagle buttons and a little hot spot. So. You know, we got the usual knapsack harness brads. We've hunted this field pretty extensively going to a new site today. So here's a little look at the hunting crew. Josh, JJ, Doug, and veteran hunter John Freeman, who's probably going to find another plate today and make us all sick. So we're headed out for a full day of hunting today in Arkansas. Yeah. We're out to the site uh, where JJ found the 1875 uh, Seated dime and uh, and the 18 and 1865 Indian head. And we got uh, John and JJ there. We're having to wear still still uh, deer season. There's Doug. Josh has gone down in the woods looking, and uh, you know we're finding a few things. Uh, Doug found a back off a comeback or a pocket watch. One I think it's pocket watch, and found an eagle cuff right there across where John is. And uh, finding a few things, I know Josh has found a couple of pistol bullets, so we're out here in the middle of nowhere and see if we can find a few things. This is Quendi again. This is something you want to steer clear of. This fire ants in these, these mounds, uh, they will bite the fire at you, so you've got to be real careful digging anywhere around those uh, fire ant hills. So Doug got bit pretty good last time. I've had been bit myself and they're no fun, so... This is one hazard of hunting out here, and it's a fairly warm day, so they'll be, you open the top, they'll come pouring out on you. The place we're hunting this morning is a combination, an old house site where J.J. found the coins yesterday and John, and uh, a Civil War uh, route through here, and uh, this is this is what we're came for right here, these uh, three ringers. So uh, I'm back to it, the gang scattered out in this area, and we'll see what, uh, see what we come up with for you. Here's the, here's the hazards of hunting out here, and it's still a little reasonably warm weather. That's a big cotton mouth right there. Josh almost stepped on that puppy, so we be real, real, real easy around here. Well, let me tell you what, uh, JJ put the kibosh on the big cotton mouth there, and uh, Josh almost, how close did you get, Josh? Uh, about six inches from him. About six inches. That's a big old snake. I tell you what, I think the woods hunting is over here, Cheryl. 
<laughs> well, we had a full day of hunting today. Got quite a few things. Some of the highlights uh, here. Uh, John got a uh, he got another he got an Indian head penny where JJ did, but we couldn't read the date. And uh, Doug got this uh, bar lid says C O. And I found a piece that's got, what was it, T.O. or something on it, uh, J.J.? Yeah, I think so. Something, and I found a eagle button. John, uh, Josh got a whole bunch of, uh, a whole bunch of, uh, not a whole bunch, but infields. And uh, Marshall and Doug field. found these railroad spikes down in the woods. And, and so John got his usual assortment of bullets that he always does. So, you know, we... Uh, had a decent day. This is a combination, old house site and a place where a lot of Civil War soldiers passed through here. They didn't count, but they passed through. So, end of day two, we're tired. What about it, Doug? Okay. What about it, JJ? Yeah. John, you tired too? I'm tired too. Me too. What about it, Josh? Heck yeah. That snake gets you stirred up? Yes. <laughs> All right, we'll see you tomorrow. As you can see, day three has started off very foggy. That's Josh there, and there's Doug. He's digging something, and here's John Freeman. John, wave at the camera. So, and we've JJ's somewhere out lost in the fog out here, so we were having a, a foggy morning starting off. I already dug a car bullet and a knapsack or harness bread, so... We're going to get back with you. Maybe we'll find some. Maybe John will find another plate today. We're back to the U.S. campsite. Yesterday we hunted the old house and the uh, along the uh, Civil War Trail. Today we're back to the uh, old house site, or the old, uh, old camp. All right, the hunters out here. John's made a good find. We don't know whether it's military or civilian. John's got a button with an A on it. That would make your heart stop thinking it was con Confederate terrain here too. Confederate artillery passed through here, but it's got a wreath around it, and we really don't at this point have any reference books to tell us if it's civilian or military. But flip it over, John. Got the shank. It's got a back mark. Uh, that's a nice uh, period button. Maybe pre pre Civil War. We don't know, but we'll we'll figure it out when we get home. So looking good. Uh, JJ has got his Chiefs shirt on here today, and. Uh, He's still crying over Peyton beating him the other night, so <laughs> we're going to get off with on with the digging here. It's, it's mist and rain kind of in this fog, so we're going to get on with it. Okay, it's about 1 o'clock uh, on December 3rd, day 2. We're getting ready to head out. We pretty well picked this place clean, so, uh, you know, uh, highlights are John's button that's got a old English A with a wreath around it on a line field, and we can't read the back mark, and I found the car bullet, and Josh found some more bullets and a nice uh, finial, and uh, you know JJ found quite a bit of stuff, including a uh, 1903 Indian head dropped here. So we've had a we had a good hunt, had pretty decent weather. Okay, guys. Heck yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. There's yeah. Snake Doctor Josh. He's a snake <laughs> handler, you know. So. We're going to head back to Tennessee and Oklahoma.